Hi there, it's Jennifer and I am here for the last video, a wrap up video of the 14 week organizational challenge that I followed along with, with a blog called A Bowl Full of Lemons. Um, yeah, 14 weeks of organizing different projects in the home. Some have been more difficult than others, um, but overall it is just great to know that I have finished this. So in this video, I'm going to show you the results of the last organizational project. Then I'm going to talk to you about some of my ideas for continued organizational projects that I'll be doing in coming weeks, telling you about some other upcoming series things that I have going on this channel, Busy Being Jen. And then I'm gonna sum it up with a little before and after slideshow of some of the more dramatic before and afters in this last 14 weeks. So uh, this last week was organizing the car. So let me go ahead and show you how it looks now. Okay, so here's my car. I got it all washed and cleaned up. And then also my main thing, I took a lot of junk out of the car, but my main thing I wanted to do was uh, straighten up well, I cleaned out the console area in the center, and then I wanted to clean up my glove compartment. I wanted to find out what was in there. So now you can see there is a lot less junk in the glove compartment. Um, okay, on the far left, I have some old pairs of sunglasses. Uh, I always think it's nice to have some sunglasses in the car in case you can't find the sunglasses that you normally use, um, just in case you're without some. Uh, there was a nifty tool in there, like some kind of a multi-tool sort of thing that I'm sure my husband put in there. Um, I have some smelly good things on the right side that I didn't realize I had, and then little tool things in the center, including a flashlight. I did not know I had a flashlight in there, but it didn't work, and so I was able to change the batteries and get it to work, so now I know I have a working flash flashlight. And I also have a, little, a few little napkins in there. Um, I like to keep napkins in my glove compartment so that I can, um, you know, sometimes things spill and stuff like that, so. So yeah, that was nice to get that all organized and it's nice to know I did have a lot of trash in there, mostly stuff like old receipts from getting my oil changed and stuff like that. But it's nice to have the car all organized and and really nice to have it all cleaned out. All right, well that is it. I feel so good about having that done. And it's all spruced up and ready for spring and everything. So, um, so yeah, just kind of a nice culminating way of finishing this whole series. So, okay, so in the weeks to come, I am going to still be doing some organizational projects. I mentioned in my last video that I've got a bookcase upstairs that I want to, I just want to make it look cuter than it is and kind of organize it a little bit, get rid of books that we don't need to keep and stuff like that. Um, I also have um, a whole bunch of food storage containers and lids that I'm going to be organizing in the coming months or whatever. I don't know when I'm going to get to it, but um, hopefully sooner rather than later. And then also a craft desk that I have. So I hope that you'll follow along. I have some other organiza not organizational. Uh, I have some other series things that I'm doing on this channel. If you haven't already seen it, I am training to walk a full marathon. And so I'm starting a series. Uh, it just went up a couple weeks ago, the first one that is called uh, Journey to Walking 26.2. If you don't have any desire to walk a full marathon, don't worry about it. The video series will have lots of tips for people who just want to get walking more. Uh, so I hope you'll join me on that. Those videos will go up most weeks, not every week, but most weeks on Sundays. And then I also have a short series, just three weeks of um, preparing for emergencies. And then of course all my makeup stuff too. So if you're not subscribed to my channel, hit that little button right there. YouTube will let you know when I upload new videos to this channel so you can check those out. But, um, so I will just, uh, you know, close my mouth now and, um, and show, no, I'm not going to close my mouth yet. Um, I'm going to show you a slideshow of those areas that bothered me the most that had the most dramatic results. One was just two drawers in my dining room that had placemats and cloth napkins in them, but I feel so good about how that looks now. One was a shelf of my coat closet that had hats, scarves, gloves, mittens, all of that. Um, there were the two sides of my guest bedroom closet, and then my favorite one of all was the organization of the closet in my bathroom. 
So thanks so much, you guys, for following along on this um, on this 14 week organizational journey of mine. And I hope I'll see you again. And stay tuned because here's the little slideshow. Bye bye, you guys. Thank you.